Hello once again. I've been asked by somebody on Facebook to comment on the Resident Evil 6 trailer. Well, on Resident Evil 6 in general, but mostly what I can glean from the new trailer. And I haven't bothered to watch the gameplay videos because I can't normally be bothered to look through the gameplay videos. I'm sorry. I, I just I just can't sit through seven minutes of some playing a game like someone could sit through seven minutes of me talking. Anyway, moving swiftly on. So, Resident Evil 6. They're taking a big new, like, uh, well, not really a new approach, but, you know, they're, they're taking this, like, big action blockbuster thing and running with it, which I'm okay with. Now, that may seem like I'm contradicting myself part of what I've said about Silent Hill and what I've said about supernatural horror and all that, but one, Resident Evil 6 is, Resident Evil is supernatural horror, it's, you know, it's bio horror, it's uh, sci-fi horror, <coughs> and which wouldn't really make a difference, but um, uh, they're being really frank about it, you know, they're presenting it as a big action, action blockbuster, you know, they're not deceiving people, they're saying, well, this is what Resident Evil is going to be. I, you know, I have no problem with games that clearly pick that. You know, clearly say, okay, we're going to be an action game. I haven't got much problem with it. I, yeah, I would prefer it if uh, Resident Evil 6 went back to uh, horror. But, nah, the action, Resident Evil 6, the action game is looking pretty fucking cool. Uh, I mean, you know, the main difference is between Resi switching to action and Silent Hill switching to action is because Resi has always been a bit silly. It's always been a bit of a, a schlocky action horror film of a game. You get the idea. It's basically around that sort of B-movie styling. It's always been a bit like that. Uh, and in recent years it took itself a bit more seriously. Uh, but still, it could be considered pretty hammy. And, uh, pardon me. And Silent Hill has always took itself seriously, apart from the UFO endings. Y you know, Silent Hill is a dark, dark game, and making it into some, like, big action blockbuster just, would just be wrong. Resident Evil has a bit less seriousness going for it. So it makes it more adaptable internationally. So, brr. Uh, then, uh, what, what's I going to say? As, uh, so in the trailer we see uh, basically, uh, you know, a run through a little run through the plot. Where it seems that our main heroes, Leon S. Kennedy and some chick I don't know, uh, are on the run from the US government who suspect them of uh, starting off a string of like biohazard attacks across America. And what's more with it is the robot robot. And uh, it isn't them, it's Mr obviously a bad guy who is working for the US government. <laughs> yeah, not too smart. But uh, and, you know, later on in the trailer you see other characters, uh, Chris Redfield and some Arnie goons are going to be more, and uh, it would seem, I'm not quite sure on this, but it would seem that Ashley Williams from Resident Evil 4 has uh, stopped being a helpless bitch, and is actually helping out in action terms, uh, along with the son of Albert Resker. Where the hell he came from, I don't know. But, um, yeah, uh, we've heard lots about Albert Resker, uh, uh, Jr., uh, including that he, his blood may hold some sort of secret to stopping the virus, but he wants to sell that sort of thing. So, the rest of your family, asshole gene, still very well there. But anyway, 
from there it just goes on to be a big action blockbuster of a trailer. You know, you see some pretty gross features. The creature design in this, it's looking pretty freaking cool, you know, you got these things that hatch from cocoons, and, you know, you got the zombies back. I'm, I'm fucking thrilled to see zombies back, you know. I, 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 you know, I love zombie games, and, you know, when Resident Evil 5 came out, I was like, okay, you know, more Maginny, but, can we please have zombies? Uh, but, you know, we got these, like, bug things, and, uh, you know, some pretty co uh, some pretty cool creature designs going, going on here. Um, and also, it would seem they're going with the whole co-op thing again. Now, got no problem with them going through the whole co-op thing again if they are going to do it well this time. That means that either the AI partner fucks off or becomes good. Got that Capcom? Because I know you're obviously watching these videos. I'm the most important, you know, commentator on YouTube about games, obviously. There aren't any anyone else more important that you might be listening to if you're listening to anyone on YouTube. Hmm. But yeah. Basically Resident Evil 6, I see no reason to condemn it yet, uh, other than, you know, it, it looks to pretty much completely abandon horror, but I'm okay with that in this instance. So yeah, that's my comment on Resident Evil 6, uh, like, subscribe, all that stuff, you know, help me out a bit. See ya!